Ayes 33, nays 29. The bill is passed. A bill that would let undocumented immigrants get a license is now in the driver's seat. The bill's made it through the legislature. It's expected to get Governor Cuomo's signature. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Nikki Dementory has a reaction from both sides of the aisle. So here we are. Another historic moment. The reality for undocumented workers to get driver's licenses here in New York State. All the more real after Monday night's vote in Albany, but not before a heated exchange between senators where critics of the green light bill sounded and off. What is the message we're saying to every legal U.S. citizen who plays by the rules? This is an irresponsible piece of legislation. More than three hours of debate, including statements from Western New York leaders, including Senator Rob Ort and Senator Chris Jacobs, both voting against the bill. Senator Ort spoke with us after the vote, saying he's, quote, very disappointed. I think most importantly, it, it waters down and, to me, cheapens U.S. citizenship New York citizenship. On the other side of the aisle, Senator Tim Kennedy voted for the bill. We're protecting people across the state. We're ensuring that our roads are safe and that we're strengthening our economy at the same time. Erie County Clerk Mickey Kern says he refuses to enforce it. In all my years, uh, almost seven years of Albany and thousands of bills that we've passed, in my time as an elected official, I think this is the most dangerous bill that could impact New York State, and it could be one of the most expensive to the taxpayers. But a spokesperson with the advocacy group Justice for Migrant Families Western New York believes it's ultimately about humanity. It's about human rights, really, at the end of the day. Uh, these are grown-ups that we feel should have the right to drive.